Now that we've got the microphone plugged in, let's get into how to record it. First thing we're gonna look at here on our channel is this button here, which is arming or disarming the channel to record. So as soon as we wanna use this channel to record audio, we're gonna click that and make sure that it shows up red. This means anything coming into this channel when we hit go is gonna record. When we're ready to record some audio, we're gonna hit this red button up here. At the moment, you can right click it and you can set it to record whatever it is that you're trying to record. I've got it set to record automation, notes and audio. At this point, the most important thing is audio because we're gonna be recording audio from the microphone. So I'm gonna be making sure that this one is selected. Once we're ready to hit record, we're gonna click that and we're gonna start playing our track. As you can see, a new audio track has started on track two in the time viewer. When we get some audio through, you're gonna see the waveforms pop up and down. Now that we've got everything rooted, ready to record, let's click play and we'll send some audio to the booth where they'll be able to monitor what they're doing and we'll get some signal back in straight away. If you look on the screen, you can see a preview of what's being recorded. The waveform showing up here, it's kind of like a ghost channel at the moment until we hit stop and finalize the recording. If we hit stop now, we can have a little listen and check out and make sure that we got the recording we needed. To listen to the playback, make sure that you disarm the record button on the master track at the top. We can mute the beat on track one so that we're only hearing what we've just recorded. I'm gonna turn the monitor speakers up as we just turn them down to record audio. We can now hear that the vocals have recorded from the microphone in the booth onto our track.